basics here, and I'm going to show you a basic tutorial on how to count, basically, with uh, clicking a button. As easy as clicking a button. Okay? As you see, I have a button here, but it doesn't have any text on it. I delete the text. So, when we click the button, so we can get its settings, we're just going to put uh, gem click dim. Well, actually, that's like dim count as string count equals button one dot text plus one button one dot text equals count. So this is what we're referencing right here. Uh, we're making dim a string. We're making count a string. And what count is, is count is the button one's number, button one text, plus one. So whatever button one is, and we should put this as an integer, not a string. And let's make count equals. Actually, in the form one design, just name text zero. Okay. Now you have button one. So basically, right here we have dim count as integer. Integer is a number. Okay. Now count equals button one dot text, which is this text, which is zero plus one equals one. So each time they click, count will equal the button text plus one. Then button text button one dot text equals count. So this is what it's gonna do. You have the zero, if you click it, it turns to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. See it's just counting right now. And count. And that's basically um, adding. If you want to do subtra subtraction, it's very simple. Just do a minus, minus one. Uh, but you want to make this like a number that's not zero. <laughs> Let's uh, change it to like 20. There you go. And it's going down 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 and now in the negatives going all the way down and that's how you do math so let's go over it real quick again we count it we we make a variable called count as an integer as a number so count is a number not a string now we make count equal button t button one text which is this which is 20 okay minus 1 which will be 19 so it's telling you that count will equal 19 so button one dot text equals 19 but then when button one text equals 19 then this will refer to 18 and make it 18 so each click it would subtract one as you see And that's a basic multiplication, uh, basic addition and subtraction of the text. Let's see now. I was gonna try to make it do multiplication, which I don't think it can. What about division? works so that's basically a division I can't believe I, I can't find multiplication it's usually an X or this and that doesn't work and that doesn't work oh wait that works I tried it earlier didn't work and there you go multiplication and I made it too high See an overflow. I made it too high <laughs> because it stopped. 
Um, and that's basically math with a button. Hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned something, actually. This is VB Basics.